Yo, what is good, everybody? You know who this is. FK, Face Karma, also known, known as Face Versus, also known as Marcus Edits, also known as a lot of other names, Face True Reality. Oh my goodness, Face True Reality. And I'm playing an arcade game on the Xbox 360 called Dust. It's like games like, it's almost like a game like Fast paced action game like what Bayonetta, Double May Cry, the arcade game that's on the Xbox 360 called um This Watches. Like that, but it's like cool. Um I don't understand it's better than those, but it's, it's still a cool game. But today I'm gonna talk about uh editing videos, man. Like you know me, I used to edit Call of Duty videos back way back when. And people used to pay me like people used to pay me what like ten dollars to edit their videos and one person edited me paid me like thirty dollars to, to edit their montage but mainly it was like ten dollars and i didn't really like it even though people don't have money like that but it was something that like forced me to edit their video because like if you expect me to do it for free don't expect it to be done like asap it's like it's free i'm doing it on my time it's not your time you paying me of course i'm a so I can get it done as quick as possible, but not make sure it's make sure it's not rushed. So like I'm saying that like ten dollars is nothing, cause like that's for me to get the school money or go out go out and get something to eat real quick money. That's like nothing I can live off type money. So I'm saying that because like um what was I about to say? Because like I spend like I keep saying like spend mainly around what. 8 hours, 8 plus hours, 10 hours, 12 hours, I didn't people montages back then. So I don't rush people's stuff, I like to try to do something different from what everybody else do. That's why I hate about the Call of Duty community. Everybody do the same shit, so I always trying always to limit myself to, to do something different or not trying to do as much as everybody else do. Because that's why I like doing I don't like being like everybody else. It's just like I have a Samsung Galaxy S2. I could have got the iPhone, but I don't like having the iPhone because everybody else got an iPhone. I don't want an iPhone because everybody else got an iPhone. That's stupid. Oh, I got, and guess what, y'all got an iPhone. I got an iPhone too. That's, I don't want an iPhone because everybody else got an iPhone. I don't get the same clothes that everybody else get because everybody else got the same clothes. I don't want to be like everybody else. It's called being different, being unique, being yourself. I don't want to be like everybody else. So that's what I'm saying. It's, it's, it's the stand out or something, but. Look, you gotta think, let's say I edit some like montage, it's like three minutes long. And I spend what, ten hours editing it. And that's around what? A dollar in an hour? That's way, 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 way below minimum wage. That's crazy low. I mean people over there in China get almost get paid more than that. If not more, I know they do. Than a dollar in an hour. Well, that's crazy. A dollar an hour? That's crazy. That's ridiculous. And like, the whole saying that because like, I go to school, uh, uh, almost almost done with college. I think I got like six months left, four, eight, nine, one, one of those six to nine months left if I pass off my classes, which I'm planning on doing anyway. And um, I said that because I got this music group. They want me to edit their music videos. And they both pay me, what, $200 to edit both of their music videos. I got paid $200 to edit one. $200 to edit another me music video. I'm gonna spend 10 hours on each one of them. Now that's way past a dollar an hour. But you know what I'm saying? I'm not saying I'm expecting y'all to pay me $200 to edit y'all monitor, but I'm saying you're not, you're not gonna really get in the way of this getting paid $10 to edit somebody's montage. I mean, if you do it for fun, cool for you, but for me, it's not gonna help me. It's not gonna benefit me trying to get a job in the editing field, getting paid $10 an hour. Edit somebody's video. You think I could put a montage in my portfolio and expect a, expect a company to hire me? It's like, oh, look at this. Look at this. I edit this montage. No, that's not going to get me nowhere. It's really not going to get me nowhere. I wouldn't mind because people still want me to edit their videos, but I'm not going to ask you for no $200 to edit your, to edit your I mean, uh, montage. But I, I, I don't know, man. I don't, I don't think I want to edit anybody's videos anymore, to be honest, because. Like, I don't watch Call of Duty montages on, no more, but I try, I probably watch like one one a week or one one a month, something like that. When I get really, 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 really bored, and I just watch like 
10 seconds of it or 30 seconds of it because everything is really the same but it, it, it changed a little I mean only thing that really changed basically is like the b-roll or this establishing shot or you know I'm talking about the stuff that's not the actual clip it's like the scenes of the map or some shit like that that's what we call in college the establishing shot or known as b-roll that's what we professionals semi-professionals college students call it and that's the only thing that really changed it looked cool man but i don't have time to learn how to do it all good looking like that i gotta get my skills up in linear editing like the stuff everybody doing now is non-linear linear oh my goodness non-linear editing if you don't know what that is i mean you don't edit in continuity you won't edit like a movie telling the story it's a montage so montage is non-linear editing and professional editing is both but it's mainly linear linear i never can fucking pronounce that word editing so man that's me i gotta stick to that and hopefully i get a job after i graduate college man making money i think out, out of college if you good enough you get paid around like what 200 300 dollars a day to out of college when you find a job something like that you get paid up to 500 dollars a day once you get known with that company you with, so that's good money. You know what I'm saying? Do what you do, and that's why I'm gonna do what I do. You know, plus, I'm like really done with Call of Duty, basically. It's, it's just boring. To me, it's the same shit. I just like trying shit different. Like, I've been on the computer for a while playing this game called Terror. Even though it's fucking annoying at times because you gotta like farm for hours and then to get a weapon better, you gotta enchant it. And he fucking fails. It's like I fucking spent like 12 hours to get save up all this fucking gold and find these fucking foldies or whatever they call them to enchant the item and it fucking fails. And I was like, God damn, took me fucking 10 hours to get all this stuff and then it fucking fails in fucking 30 seconds. That is just a waste of 10 hours. That's to fucking do that. That shit is fucking stressful. But I get through it, man. Still playing the game. You should go check it out. Got Battlegrounds on there that just came out, what, last Tuesday, yeah, last Tuesday, it's cool. You got a 15 versus 15 team. PVP is cool, man. GBG or whatever y'all call it. All them MMO people. I know everything. I know Guild Guild War 2 came out today. People playing that. I don't play that. I don't play a lot of MMO games. Only played three in my whole entire lifetime. Mainly four. First two was like PSU, PSO, and I played a little bit of what um. Uh, well, like, I um, I played it like three days, three days before Terra came out, cause I heard the Terra first, and I wanna get like used to MMO, so I played like I um, for like four days before Terra came out, and I played Terra. I don't know if you really wanna count that. I was playing that, but I've been chilling, man, making this money. I'm editing their videos like now, and I got like, like done. I'm like two percent done with one of them, and I'm like twenty five percent done with one of them. So I don't wanna rush their videos because like they paid me two hundred dollars each to edit their videos and I don't wanna rush their shit. But make sure what make sure I wanna make sure they like it and stuff. And I, I just needed need this money, man. I just bought hundred dollar wireless headphones, bought me I mean hundred dollars wireless headphones to walk around the house to listen to music and stuff. Then I brought me more like kinda like studio professional headphones for like what? Twenty dollars because it was like eighty dollars at first, but it was like half price off, and it, it was they was on sale for half price off. And then I had this coupon that took it off half price, so I bring it down to like twenty dollars. So I was happy about that, and I've been good, man. So hopefully I could do this commentary with that one that one Call of Duty gamer soon, man. Cause I've been busy, got a research paper to do this week, and I got a ten minute speech to do in public speaking class, and got a another speech, thirty minute speech to group speech in psychology class i gotta make sure i get all this shit done and edit these videos before i do anything with anybody but this come to the end of this commentary so i'll talk to you guys fucking later i'm out